Before we can get started, we need to uh, create our picture, and we're going to be editing our picture using Paint. So go ahead and get into Paint. Once you get into Paint, you're going to need to set your attributes. So go into Image and select Attributes. A window is going to open up, and when you get into that window, you're going to select Inches. So change the unit to Inches, and then adjust the width to be 12.5 inches and the height to be 6.5 inches. After you've adjusted the Microsoft Paint, you're going to go into Google and you're going to go ahead and find your map of your university. I'm going to go ahead and look for Portland State University. So go ahead and type in the name of your university into a search engine. If you add campus map, um, it should narrow your search and bring you right to a university map. should be the top one on your list. So we'll go ahead and open up your uh, campus map. Once you get in there, go ahead and just right click the image if you're on a PC and say copy image. You're going to take that copied image, it's on your clipboard right now, and you're going to go back into Microsoft Paint and you're going to paste it into Paint. Uh, you're going to see more canvas than you have for your image, uh, but we're going to adjust the size of that image anyway. Um, you'll see that there's a little uh, border all the way around it. You, anything you grab and click and move, that border is going to move around until you go into something else. I'm going to resize it by clicking one of the corners and making it a little shorter so that I have space at the bottom and the sides. I'm going to make it a little bit smaller. I want some more space in the bottom so I can add the name of the university. So to add the name of the university, you're going to go and you're going to select the text button, draw a space around where you're going to have the, te the text. In this case, it's going to say Portland State University. I like to see the text toolbar so that I can adjust the height of the text. Um, it needs to be rather large here. Go ahead and type it in. So Portland State University. I need it to be larger because it's going to go across. So you highlight it, adjust your um, size of your text. If the number is not apparent that it, or listed, you can go ahead and add your own number. You see that I've... Uh, now got a space where the letters have been cut off. Just readjust your text box size and there you go. Now it's possible that I don't have it exactly where I need it. To adjust that we can move it, select the little box there, grab the whole area around the text and now you can move the text and put it where you want it. From there you're going to go ahead and now we're going to save it. You're going to save it as JPEG, so go save as. Put it into a folder where you're, you know where you'll be able to find it. I'm going to go ahead and put it here in Beverly and then give it a name that will uh, that you'll remember what it is. Remember you need to switch it to a JPEG format. So switch it to JPEG, give it a name and put it in a folder where you will be able to find it. Once you're done with that we're going to go ahead and put it into Excel. 